In today's beginner to intermediate lesson, we're going to be talking about the 2 over 2 fraction fill. And here's what it looks like. We've talked about fraction fills once before on this channel. You can find our first lesson in the description. Inside a fraction we have two numbers, the numerator or top number and the denominator or bottom number. We call a fraction fill a fraction fill because the top number is going to represent the amount of strokes performed on the hands and the bottom number will represent the amount of strokes performed on the feet. In the case of today's 2 over 2, that's just 2 on the hands or right left up top and then 2 on the feet, right left on the bottom. Before we break it down any further, this video was sponsored by Drumeo. Drumio, the number one brand in online drum education. Start learning to drum today using Drumio Edge and get 30 days free with my link in the description. Drumio.com slash Wyattstav. The focus here is the consistency in timing and distance between individual strokes. It's one thing to be able to play a single stroke. It's another thing to keep that single stroke as consistent when moving from upper body to lower body. So how do we work the concept to develop the consistency? Once comfortable, alternating between the right side, upper and lower, and then the left side, upper and lower, separate, combine those two, switching back and forth every second bar. Now we can move to the right hand lead, top then bottom variant, which is the two over two. So right left on top, right left bottom. These are great exercises to develop this concept, this focus of keeping the strokes consistently spaced. As a bonus concept too, taking the left hand lead and driving the pattern with that. Go left, right, left, right. Almost every time I want to lead with the right hand when I get down to the foot level. I'm going left, right, and then on occasion I go right, left on the bottom because I'm so used to the... There is a couple extremely simple exercises that's going to develop the consistency working back and forth between the feet and the hands. This time, instead of a right, left, or a left, right version of the sticking, maybe try a double stroke. Make sure you are not moving up in tempo until the strokes are consistent. And when you go up in tempo, if you are sacrificing the cleanness of the playing for a higher speed, you're not really executing the pattern. You're just cheating yourself and developing bad habits. Always make sure that a speed is product of comfort, not something that you're pushing yourself into. Now let's take this two over two concept and warm up at the kit with it. We're going to move through each element one at a time. So we'll start with the snare and then move through the toms. That's going to look like this. Come along with me and let's loop this exercise at a few different tempos. We're really just focused on consistent, even strokes.
The next thing we're going to do is learn the sticking for the fill that was demonstrated at the beginning of this lesson video. That fill is the intro buildup from one of my most recent covers, the song Dark Days by Parkway Drive. The first half repeats itself four times and it looks like this. If you have a different number of toms, you're just gonna wanna work the amount of total strokes in through those toms as evenly as possible. Now, as I said, that first half will be repeated four times in the actual lick, and then when we move into the second half, three groups of four two over two fraction fills. The first group is gonna start with the snare and the rack tom, then we're gonna move the right hand in the lead to the second fraction fill over to the floor tom. And now two more, like what we started with, back to the snare. The second group is the exact same thing. The only difference is instead of going to the second tom, I'm going to go to my third tom. Now we come into the third grouping of four two over two fraction fills. It's the same as the first. Only difference here is coming out of it, we're going to put a flam between one of your toms and your snare drum. I'm putting all those together just so you can see it's going to look like this. Now pick up your sticks and let's move through a few different tempos together. The final tempo we're going to hit is going to be 240 beats per minute. Putting the subdivision and the tempo values aside, the most important thing you can do here is make sure that as you're moving up in tempo with me, the upper body, the lower body, as you move back and forth, all of it is as even and consistent as possible to create that sort of machine gun feeling when moving through the toms. With that said, let's check out a few tempos now. So that's been pretty much it for the lesson, but I'm actually gonna take you guys through one more bonus fill that I want to introduce to you to get you really thinking creatively. We don't need to stick to exclusively the snare and the toms. This is also a really great concept to use with the cymbals as well. So we're gonna actually use the snare, use the rack, but then move up to the cymbal level and back. The sticking for this final fill is gonna look like this. So you saw there, I took the bell and I took the splash cymbal. Now, if you don't have a bell and a splash at your kit, maybe mix it up with just hitting a ping off the ride and your hi-hat, preferably something a little bit faster. That's why I went for two kind of like effect style cymbals instead of going for crashes. And this is just gonna make a really cool sounding fill. It's a little bit more creative than just sticking this two over two concept to the toms and the snare. Pick up the sticks and let's play this at a few different tempos with me.
Thank you guys for checking out my lesson on the power of the two over two fraction fill. If you did enjoy, make sure to hit the like button as well. Comment down below some ideas for future lessons, maybe some things that you want to see broken down here on the channel. Huge shout out to the sponsor of this video, Drumeo. If you want to take your playing to the next level, use my link, drumeo.com slash Wyattstav, and you can get 30 days free on Drumeo Edge and check out the Drumeo method as well as all the other resources that they have to offer on that site. Big thanks to my Patreon family for making all my videos possible, and I will see you guys all very soon with something new.